This is Mech 23B, a multi-cylinder engine measurement, and we're going to measure the cylinder head, push rods, and rocker arms right now. So the first thing we want to look at when we're talking about a cylinder head is we want to look for cracks. So if we look over on our cylinder head here, the places we most want to look for them are in between where the spark plug hole goes over and is close to uh, the valve port and also between the valve ports. And also sometimes, not very often, but sometimes you'll get a crack that goes across from a water jacket to a valve port too. So that's cracks. When we're looking at warpage, warpage is um, how much the crankshaft warps. And so what you're going to do is you're going to get a straight edge. You come get the straight edge from Mr. Martin's and then you're going to stretch it across the cylinder head, the bottom of the cylinder head. And then you're going to take a feeler gauge and try and slide it underneath at different points. The thickest feeler gauge that you can slide under is the amount of warpage that you have. And so you're going to check this in several different locations. You're going to go uh, one, two, three. You're also going to go crosswise like that. And then in between each cylinder like that. So you're going to do it a lot of times. You're just going to lay the straight edge across, the metal straight edge across, and try and slip the smallest feeler gauge underneath. If you can't get anything underneath, then it's perfectly flat. Good. We have several other things here. We have a core plug condition. Core plugs are typically on the back or the front of the cylinder head, and those are expansion plugs, so they would go down into where your water jackets go and you're just going to check for leakage there. And mounting studs and nuts, those are on the top side of the cylinder head. Just checking to make sure all the threads are good because we have a lot of pressure with the rocker arms moving up and down.